Are you able to pronounce rural in American English? A few people have told me that this is a really hard word for them, and I agree. In fact, I think it's one of the most difficult words to pronounce in English. It's made up completely of sounds that give a lot of non-native English speakers problems. It begins with the R sound, is followed by the R sound, and finishes with a dark L. Wow! So don't go anywhere. Stay tuned to learn exactly how to say this tough word correctly. In order to pronounce rural correctly, we need to first take a look at how to pronounce the R in American English. The most important thing to remember from pronouncing both the R and R sound is that your tongue cannot touch any other part of your mouth. It just floats in the middle of your mouth, like this. R. R. Look at my tongue. It's not touching anything up above. R. R. See, it's just in the middle there. And both of these sounds, R and R, are tense. So you need to feel the muscles of your mouth and your tongue as you pronounce both of these. Both of these muscles should be working hard, right? Strong. R, R. See the muscles in my face here? And note my tongue. R, R. Hold it tight. Let's try a few practice words that begin with the R. Red. Right. Rock. The R sound is almost exactly the same as the R sound. It just has a little vowel sound before it. R. It has kind of that uh sound before it. R. R. Your mouth is somewhat open for both of these sounds. R. Notice it's open a little, not a lot. And don't forget to round your lips. And keep those muscles tight. Err, err. And make sure your tongue does not touch the roof of your mouth. Let's try a few practice words for the err sound. Her, fur, sir, work, and turn. Want more practice with the err sound? Then check out my err pronunciation and spelling video. Now let's try the first syllable of rural together. Rur. Rur. Look carefully at my mouth as I pronounce it and try to imitate my mouth position and pronunciation. Rur. Rur. I suggest that you check your mouth in a small pocket mirror to make sure your mouth looks just like mine. The last syllable in rural is a dark L. The dark L is made farther back in your mouth and your tongue needs to be low. The front of your tongue is less important. It's the back of your tongue that is more important. In order to position the back of your tongue correctly though, it's usually helpful for the front of the tongue to be touching something. A common error is curling the tongue backwards. So I suggest touching the alveolar ridge up here. Oh, oh. Or even biting the tip of your tongue in order to keep it down. Oh, oh. That's not exactly how an American would do it, but it's close enough to sound good. Now let's try the dark L together now. Oh, oh. Want more practice with the dark L? Then check out my dark L video. Now let's put the whole word together. Rural, rural. And rural is a two-syllable word. Since it's an adjective, 
right? It's describing something. You can predict that the stress will probably be on the first part, since two-syllable adjectives usually stress the first part. And yes, it does follow that rule. So say it like this, rural. The first syllable is much louder and longer than the second. Rural. Let's try a couple of practice sentences. Rural life can be lonely. I come from a family of rural farmers. And after all this, if you still find this word too difficult or too distracting for you to say in conversation, you might consider using a synonym instead. The word countryside may be an easier choice for you. Instead of saying, I live in a rural area, you could just say, I live in the countryside. What English words do you find hardest to say? Do you avoid these words and use others as a substitute? If so, let me know the words you find most difficult in the comments section below. And I'd also like to know the words you use to replace your difficult words. If you'd like more practice with difficult words, I have a whole playlist full of hard words for you. And I'd also like to recommend my video, 10 Most Mispronounced English Words. Like rural, you'll find some more er and dark L words in that list. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it, and please leave me some comments so I can make videos of the words you find most difficult. Thanks for watching!